What a game last night. Pedro Gomez joins us now on Coast to Coast. Pedro, USA able to hold Japan off last night for the first time they're headed to the championship game of the WBC. And you know what's interesting to me is that these guys came together just two weeks ago and not really knowing what to expect, they've gelled and look at where they are. For fans at home that are just tuning into the WBC, how would you describe what they've been able to accomplish so far, Pedro? Can we welcome in our NFL experts, Jim Trotter and Jeff Saturday. So Cam's going to have surgery next week, uh, Jim. You spoke with a trainer from the Panthers regarding this injury. What are they go expecting of him going forward? Right, it wasn't a trainer. Oh, man, Jeff, what do you think made Cam susceptible to this type of injury? Well, I mean, just you, you look at his career, you got to pay the piper on it. I absolutely agree with him 100% on that. The league has to step in here. And in particular, last year when the, when the uh, when Aaron Rodgers threw it to the tight end Rodgers yeah. on the Hail Mary, the play before, it was a face mask penalty, a 15-yard penalty, and it was like a brushing of Aaron Rodgers' mask. If that's Cam Newton, there ain't no chance he's getting that flag. So we can think whatever we want about that. But again... And this whole situation, really. Absolutely. Sure, absolutely. All right, I want to switch gears with you guys. Let's talk about Tony Romo. We, we really haven't heard much of him. He's still with the Cowboys. Why has it been so silent for the quarterback? Because I think Jerry is. For Jerry Jones, he's waiting for a team to get desperate. Like, wait mm -hmm. that last little bit. Sure. Oh, maybe this quarterback's not looking as good in the OTAs if we get there. In time for training camp, that this is a non-issue for the offense going forward. So is this a team that right now is on mode for a plan B in case it's worse than they expect? And one of the trainers I talked to said to me, has been hit more than any other quarterback <laughs> since he entered the NFL in 2011. Derek Anderson is a Panthers backup quarterback who will be getting a lot of work this offseason. Thank you guys for the insight. Thanks. On Coast to Coast. So LeBar Ball, apart from being the father of UCLA star Lonzo, we know him for making bold statements about his kids. But recently, LeBar made some comments on a current superstar's kids. Take a listen to what he said to Chris Broussard on his podcast on FS1. Weather, right? Yes. Currently? Yes. He's retired a couple you, times. You got the hockey in there, man. Ah, I'm nervous. Get some hockey in. What do you, uh, do you have a uh, list pulled? Well,